I'm halfway through an orienteering course with medium navigation. I think I'm doing pretty well. But I can't help noticing that everyone else seems to be moving smoothly through their controls without really stopping. I think I'm going to need a little help on this one. Thanks for dropping by. No problem, how can I help? Well I've noticed that everybody seems to be going through the control circle so much faster than I do and so much more efficiently. Well that's control flow. It's a really good thing to practice even when you're learning. There's two parts to control flow. The first is the approach. What you have to do is check what the feature is on and what the control feature says it's on. You also need to check which side of the feature the control is on as well as the number of the control. In this competition, I'm using control descriptions with international symbols. Instead of describing the feature in English, international symbols denote individual features. The position of the feature relative to others nearby, and which side of the feature the control flag will be on. Other features, such as drinks and radio controls, are shown in the last column. So all I need to do is learn the symbols off by heart? Yeah, that's right. It's normally pretty easy to pick up on though, because the symbols on your map are normally the same as the symbols on the control descriptions. Now you said there were two parts to control flow. The first was the approach. What's the second? Well, the second part is planning your exit direction from the control before you enter the control. Sounds pretty simple. Yeah, right. Let's race you to the next control. Okay, you're on.